this sentence should be read out at step one. It's basically a similar syntax with a paragraph below and with those dashes around it, just like this simple tiny description. So this is the part that should be spoken out loud uh, that describes animation step one. You can do this then afterwards for one correct one. Animation step two. Today we are cooking alphabet soup and are the following ingredients. First, chop the onions finely and then spread them in a large pot with the olive oil. Then deglaze the water and as it starts to boil, bring the peel carrots directly into the pot. I can go back again to the last. First, chop the onions finely and then spread them in a large pot with the olive oil. Step step forward, actually. And this is just the idea. And what it uses, it uses, in this case, Chrome has a pretty good text-to-speech output, actually. Uh, you have to test this for your. Chrome is pretty good, but there are a few on Windows, uh, on Mac, that should be also quite good on Android, and you've seen this also on these feature phones. It's the same. It tries to, the browser accesses a text-to-speech engine that Chrome has its own, but the other one text-to-speech engine that's offered in most cases by the operating system. And if there is no one offered, uh, we also have a fallback. So in this case, we prefer browser-based TTS text-to-speech but they are also like uh, using open service for this the responsive voice for the non-commercial. That's why we have to display it like this. And what you can, it depends. So this kind of might be because it sends uh, the text somewhere else. It, and uh, depending on uh, how much the service are using, uh, the text might become a bit, might be a bit yeah, come later or not that in time if you're using the browser base. So prefer to use a browser that supports text-to-speech output, otherwise you can use this uh, responsive voice. And uh, as a last feature, and this works uh, offline, so actually you can style this blah, 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 if you want to, where this translate with Google, so experimentally. So it's not that Google and the translation engine, they are always aware of this uh, uh, content or that your students are actually using it or something like this. But if you click on this, I want to translate the content, experimentally and I don't have to the 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 the, the part that the, the script actually the code the code that is necessary is then afterwards injected into the little script so I don't know Google uh, adds probably some more stuff to it and then we can change the language probably into let's try Esperanto French So wait a second. Ah, it already translated, as you see, so in this part. And if it, everything worked well, so we also have this. We can switch onto the uh, manual mode. Also, you see, you see the text is translated. Uh, but we have also methods. If you're doing, for example, like a language course, so you, you mix up different languages, you could also, we're in total control of this, what uh, Google sees. So we can also say in this part should be actually stay. For example, if you have a code block, this should not be touched uh, by Google, by the Google Translator. This part should be this, uh, and this one should be not. So this is just like an easy feature. And if it, everything works well, I'll check to this one. So you see the code is below, and if we increase it a bit, so it's better rendered like this. So it's another kind of visualization. So this is just one opportunity. You have a fixed uh, piece of not of code, you have your fixed course actually, but you can use also the freely available, available methods like Google Translate, text to speech engine to translate this probably so that one of your students uh, is using this language, one of your using the students this, day, this language, but you have created it in another one. You know? So just like, of course, the best way is always to translate the content, to have it separately so that you have specifically changed it for the culture. So it's like, like we've learned so many Yeah. 